Mark takes bridge care. Mold Tech Bridge Care is a completely new scaffold system that revolutionizes the renewing, demolition, and rebuilding of the edge beams of bridges. This revolutionary technique is a simply ingenious solution. Compared with the old way of repairing, the scaffold system developed by Mold Tech is easier, faster, and more accurate, so it directly answers the challenge that the renewing of bridge maintenance faces. With Mold Tech, the work can be carried out twice as fast. The mounting of the bridge care system starts when the material is brought to the site by a vehicle equipped with a crane. The parts are mounted straight from the vehicle without any need for storage. Before that, the preparation work has been carried out. A one meter wide strip has been removed from the surface of the bridge deck. Concrete ballards have been installed to protect the work site. The permanent railing has been removed and the temporary installed. The fixing plates of the bridge care system trestles have been installed. The plates will be attached to the deck with bolts. This starts the actual building of the bridge care system. The trestles are lifted from the vehicle to plates that have fixing bolts. After this, the walking platforms are raised. The work stage proceeds hand in hand with the installation of the railing, so that a rail is always put in place after a part of the platform is installed. Parallel installation platforms will be next and they will be placed on the forks of two successive trestles. In order for the system to be firm and safe, the next work stage is the fixing of the counterpart. The fixing is carried out mechanically because chemical anchoring would slow down the drying process. For the anchoring, holes will be drilled into the deck. When the counterparts of two trestles have been installed, the installation platform will be moved over one trestle interval onto the forks of the two following trestles and the anchoring continued. The demolition platforms are built to collect the building waste properly. The platforms are installed manually. The broken and dilapidated edge beam is removed by water spiking in the bridge care system. With water spiking, the work trace is even and the removing is carried out fast and accurately. The spiking waste will be transferred from the platforms to containers that have been placed under the water spiking points. When the spiking has been carried out, it is time to build a mold in the form of the base of the edge beam. The mold will be tightened to its position against the lower surface of the deck with the lifting device of the fork. After the base mold, it is time for the vertical mold. Its lower surface will be placed level with the upper level of the deck. After this, the edge beam will be iron mounted and the vertical mold outside will be installed. Now everything is ready for casting. When the concrete is solid enough, the vertical molds will be removed and the demolition platform lowered with the lifting device of the fork so the base mold of the edge beam can be removed. Now the other parts of the system can be removed in the reverse order of installation. Mold Tech Bridge Care is a faster and easier way of repairing bridges. Bridge Care is a comprehensive process directing system in which each work stage follows the one before seamlessly and without delay. The freely adjustable scaffold arrangement is suitable for almost all repairing sites. Because of its light structure, bridge care is easy to transport and install. The assembly time of the work site can be measured in hours. The system enables work to progress regardless of the season. The covered and heated working environment makes it impossible to work under difficult weather conditions and freezing will not slow down the project. When using the bridge care system, the need to redirect or slow traffic and other limitations are smaller. 
BridgeCare offers a safe workspace and unique accuracy in the quality of the outcome. BridgeCare is also environmentally friendly because the parts of the system can be reused.